Okay, so we've got another inequality problem, number five. But this one says, which graph represents the solution set to this inequality? Remember, solution set with inequalities means there's more than one answer. Because there's more than one answer, I need to show it on these graphs by doing my arrows. So first I need to solve it and then pick which one matches the situation. So we do our river of love again, or your train tracks, whatever you like. And then again, we're doing sad Meg. Gem Das backwards, because we're working backwards to figure out what X is. So the first thing we need to do, are we adding or subtracting anywhere? Yep. We have x plus 5. What's the opposite of x plus 5? I need to subtract 5 from both sides. 5 and 5, zeroes out. So all I'm left with is x on that side. x is less than, what's 7 minus 5? 2. We have x is less than 2. So now I need to come back over here and see what matches this situation. If my sign looks like that, is that going to be open or closed circle? That's an open circle. It's only closed if you have an equal sign, less than or equal to, greater than or equal to. Open if you have less than or greater than. All of these have open circles, so that's good. Now we need to check for the number. We have x is less than 2. Here we have a dot on 12. 12 is not right. And then same thing on b. We can't have dots on 12. So that narrows it down to c and d. This is important that you know how you say this sign. <coughs> x is less than 2. All these numbers for x need to be smaller than 2. Because remember, it opens to the bigger side. So which of these two shows answers that are less than or smaller than 2? C. D shows all these numbers that are greater than 2. So that is not right. 